A local mother says the father of her five month old baby was shot and killed by another woman. Action News Jax told you Thursday JSO ruled that shooting justifiable. That's because Brandon Rashad Johnson broke into the woman's home Wednesday morning. Action News Jax investigator Paige Kelton joins us live in the newsroom now. Paige, Johnson had a history of domestic violence. John, violence involving at least two women that he's fathered children with. I spoke to one of those women today. She told me she's sad that her son's father was killed and that she knows the woman who pulled the trigger. JSO records show Brandon Johnson broke into a woman's home in the middle of the night Wednesday, and that woman shot him, calling 911 saying he'd broken in. Police won't say if the two knew each other, but according to court records, Brandon Johnson was set to appear in court that morning on a domestic violence injunction. Earlier today, I spoke with one of Johnson's ex girlfriends, who, according to arrest records, was pistol whipped by the 24 year old last December when she broke up with him. Prosecutors declined to press charges. Today on the phone, she reacted to Johnson's death, saying, I was devastated, hurt, heartbroken. We had a rough patch, but he's the father of my son. It isn't easy to swallow. She also told me she knows the woman who shot and killed Johnson and believes they had a relationship. Because the shooting was ruled justified, there will be no charges in Brandon Johnson's death. In the newsroom, Paige Kelton, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.